Any idea? <laughs> We're not sure if the axles are really strong enough for what we want to do. Or I'm not sure anyway. The you were designed or was it? Sort of. So we have a really big reduction transmission mm -hmm. so that the output is really slow but has a lot of torque to it. Mm -hmm. um, and we have a disengaging gear. Um, and then it's basically a catapult okay. driven down by rubber bands mm -hmm. or pulled up by rubber bands. So the motor slowly works down the catapult and then it disengages it from the motor, mm -hmm. which launches yeah, it. One motor or how many motor what? Okay. It depends on how fast we want to crank it down, I guess, okay. or how, how much reduction we need. Uh, how can you uh, feed two. the ball? We'll probably, oh, we'll need another way to feed the ball, won't we? Yeah, you need a hand feed. <laughs> like a catapult. Mm -hmm. And so it has one motor that will drive down um, the catapult against the rubber band, so it has okay. lots of reduction, and so it can pull down a very stiff rubber band. Okay. But it also um, needs to be able to release to quickly launch the ball, and so um, it basically has sort of a clutch mm -hmm. um, that is disengaged or engaged by this motor that will uh, disconnect the, the output of this transmission from the, the axle of our shooter. And so okay. it can quickly spring and shoot the ball so how can you make that? Can you? Um, basically, uh, this this is like the output of the transmission. Okay. It rotates here. The slow. And that is a slow one. Very very slow. Yeah. Yes. And this motor uh, can pull away or engage the clutch. Oh, um, okay, I see. So when when it's hooked up to here, uh -huh. the axle stay in line. Uh huh. Uh, but. Uh, the rotation of this motor a little bit engage or disengage okay I see so you make the kind of the crunch mm -hmm. that's good oh. nice so that's like hey. our maximum ball throw right there again again at least with that many rubber bands Okay. You need a little more juice on there. Huh? You put more rubber bands. <laughs> more. Okay. I think we can. I think we can twist that hard with this stretch. Yeah. I think we can put Just more on there. Yeah. Triple. Yeah. 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 Oh, the worm gear is like walking off. <laughs> if I just let it go, it will be out of it. Hmm. Yeah. I talking about um, instead of using the axle to twist this down, mm -hmm. um, using like a string to pull it down. Okay. And so it'd still be like the same sort of releasing mechanism, but we'd be pulling it down with a string <laughs> instead of twisting the axle. This is pretty tough on the axle. Like even with rubber, one rubber band, is it like twisting? No, one right? rubber band, it was fine. It was, it was fine. twisting a little bit, so. Yeah, it's should be. See, it doesn't spin as freely as it used to. So the two sides aren't lined up right. Yeah. It might have something to do with how this is mounted. Yeah, you might be right. I might have to redo that. I think you need just some line up and align here. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Maybe test and then fix it. You're just holding it there. Here, take this one. Yeah, that's better, I think. So this would have to... Because basically, if you're trying to line these... We have a motor that will twist sort of like a pulley with a string on it. Uh -huh. So the string will be attached to the catapult itself. Uh -huh. And so as it twists it down, it cranks, cranks down the catapult. Uh -huh. um, in order to release, in order to have it spring up, 
the axle that is connected to the pulley that pulls the string um, will disengage from the motor. Mm -hmm. um, and so that's what this motor is for. It yanks basically the gears away from each other. Mm -hmm. If you look there, um, the gears engage or disengage. Mm -hmm. So when it disengages, it should just free spin, mm -hmm. and then the rubber band will just the, pull it up. Okay, pretty much. It's a little bit of stuff to do. It's okay. not quite uh, sturdy. So, Thank you. we don't have a string today. String. Hmm? All we have now is just refining. Refine? Oh, too much <laughs> tweaking. <or spin. laughs> Too many rubber band, I think. <laughs> Too much rubber band, there's no such thing. <laughs> oh, did you double click that? The second one? Yeah. <laughs> Besides, is there still a guide learning for a presentation and like the PowerPoint? Yeah, after, yeah. What? Yeah. Can you pull that? Oh, that's really strong. Oh, <laughs> I told you. <laughs> so the axle.